वेलकम टू डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड टेलीकम्युनिकेशन एट विद्यालंकर इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी इन दिस डिपार्टमेंट वी हैव टेकन दिस न्यू इनिशिएटिव टू स्टार्ट आवर ओन यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस यूट्यूब चैनल वी आर गोइंग टू अपलोड ऑल ओवर एक्सपेरिमेंट्स वीडियो वैल्यू एडेड कोर्स वीडियो और एनी अदर इम्पॉर्टेंट वीडियोज दिस मटीरियल विल बी अवेलेबल टू ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स इन मुंबई यूनिवर्सिटी एंड दिस मटीरियल विल हेल्प स्टूडेंट्स Uh, to enhance their learning not just in their classroom but even outside the classroom i hope that everyone will uh, like this our effort and in case of any query comments anything they can put it in the comment box thank you greetings to all welcome to analog electronics lab 1 uh, today we would be looking into the modified version of fixed wires in the modified version extra resistor is used as the emitter resistor our main motive is to design one modified uh, fixed wire circuit the given values are vcc is equal to 5 volt ic is equal to 5.5 milliamp vc is equal to 1.15 volt beta value is 375 and vb as we know is 0.7 so now we have to find the values of re rd rc and id So here, as we know that V is always one tenth of VCC, approximately equal to one tenth of VCC. So V is equal to zero point five volts. Uh, we know that I is equal to IC and IB is equal to IC by beta. So R E resistance is equal to V E upon I E ohms law. That gives us V E is equal to IC. That is R E is equal to zero point one kilo. Now applying KV like the output, we get VCC minus ICRC minus VC minus IRE is equal to zero. IRE is V. That gives us RC is equal to VCC minus VC minus V upon IC. That is RC is equal to zero point six kilo. Uh, IB is equal to IC upon V. That gives us IB value is equal to fifteen microamp. Applying KV as the input, we get VCC minus IBRB minus VBE minus IRE is equal to zero. Note that IRE is VE. That gives us RB is equal to VCC minus VBE minus VE upon IB. That gives us the value of RB as 253 kilo. Now let us look into the implementation of the modified fixed bias in the grid. As we have obtained the values of VE. RE RC IB and RB now let us implement the fixed modified fixed base bias circuit on the breadboard uh, note that for BC547 BJT the rightmost is emitter the middle one is base and the leftmost is collector here the emitter is connected to a 100 ohm resistance and that is connected to ground this is the 100 ohm resistance uh, the base resistance is of 253 kilo ohms for getting 253 kilo ohms we have Uh, we have used 220 kilo ohm resistors and 33 kilo ohm resistors, and they are connected in series. Here we can see that 220 kilo ohm and 33 kilo ohm resistors are connected in series, and that is given to VCC. Uh, the red wire indicate VCC, whereas the black wire indicate ground. The collector resistance is of 0.6 kilo ohm, that is 600 ohms. For getting 600 600 ohm, and the available Our uh, resistance were of 330 ohms. That's why we have used two 330 ohms uh, each, and they are connected in series. That gives us a total of 660 ohms. Uh, this is also given to VCC. Now let us look at whether the obtained values match with the inputs that we are giving, and whether the designing is correct. Apply to the modified fixed bias circuit. Uh, this is positive, and this is ground. We have set the power supply at 5 volts. Uh, now let us check the value of VC. The uh, VC value should be 1.15 volts as we have considered it. Uh, for checking VC, we keep give the positive uh, multimeter to collector and the negative to emitter, and that gives us 1.1, which is very close to 1.15 volts. So we can say that the VC value is correct in terms of designing. Uh, now let us check the value of IC. For IC, we use a milliammeter. We connect the positive of milliammeter to the collector, the negative to ground. 
uh, the value that we should get is 5.5 milliamp according to the designing and we get is also very close to 5.5 milliamp so the designing is correct in terms of IC as well uh, now let us check the value of IB the uh, value of IB that we should get is uh, 15 microamp we connect the microamp the positive of the microamp to the base and the negative of the microamp to ground uh, now here we can see that the value that we should get for IB is 15 microamp and we get the value is of 17 microamp so that is even very close to 15 microamp so we can say that the designing of modified pitch bias is successful uh, thank you